Scrubbing in for surgery is a crucial process that helps maintain a sterile environment to prevent infections. Here's a detailed description of how to scrub in, focusing on the different soaps and hand washes involved, such as povidone iodine and chlorhexidine, along with the steps of hand washing. The bind links for the povidone iodine and chlorhexidine surgical hand strip are provided in the description of the video. Preparation Begin by wearing clean, sterile attire, including a gown and gloves. Make sure your nails are short and free from nail polish. Remove any jewelry from your hands and wrists. Initial Hand Wash Start by washing your hands with regular soap and water. Scrub your hands and forearms vigorously for at least 20 seconds, ensuring you clean all surfaces thoroughly. Povidone Iodine Hand Wash Dispense a small amount of povidone iodine scrub solution onto your palm. Spread the solution over your hands, fingers, and forearms up to the elbows. Ensure complete coverage. Scrub your hands and forearms for about 3 minutes, paying special attention to your nails, cuticles, and between your fingers. Rinse thoroughly with warm water, starting from your fingertips and moving towards your elbows. Allow the water to run off your elbows to avoid contaminating your hands. Chlorhexidine Hand Wash Apply a generous amount of chlorhexidine scrub solution to your hands and forearms. Work the solution into a lather, ensuring you cover all areas of your hands, fingers, and forearms up to the elbows. Scrub for about 3 minutes, focusing on your nails, cuticles, and spaces between your fingers. Rinse your hands and forearms thoroughly with warm water, starting from your fingertips and moving towards your elbows. Final Hand Rinse Perform a final rinse by allowing water to run down your elbows and off your fingertips to minimize contamination. Dry your hands and forearms using a sterile towel or air dryer. Remember to keep your hands elevated to avoid touching non-sterile surfaces. Donning Sterile Attire Once your hands are dry, put on your sterile gown, ensuring not to touch any non-sterile surfaces. If you are using gloves, put them on after the gown. Ensure that the gloves are properly fitted and cover your wrists completely. Remember, the entire scrubbing process is designed to minimize the risk of introducing microorganisms into the surgical environment. It's essential to follow each step carefully and diligently. While both povidone iodine and chlorhexidine are effective antiseptic solutions, the choice between the two may depend on the surgeon's preference and the patient's medical history. Always prioritize patient safety by maintaining a sterile field and following proper surgical scrub protocols.